Hi, girls. Hi. Hey. I'm assuming you guys were quite young when The Last Charlie's Angels came out. Do you guys have like any recollection of it, or did you have like a dream or goal to be a part of Charlie's Angels? Oh, yeah. We all watch the movies, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't think I'll ever forget um, Drew Barrymore like tumbling down that hill, <laughs> and then the way the boys react to her, like standing up <laughs> naked and then her cut to her and like I can't remember if it's like a slip knot or like a weird like like world wrestling t-shirt mm -hmm. but I'm like you're so cool, cool. <laughs> yeah. 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 that was me watching you guys yesterday oh, so <laughs> anyway, how important is it for you guys to be part of a movie that really highlights like women empowerment and also women supporting women especially in a time like now mm. We need each other, yeah. Yeah. and that it's like such a good feeling when you find your your clan, and then you realize that it's actually like not hard to find, and that we're everywhere. Mm. Um, that's what the movie does. That's sort of modernizes. It. This is the the take that we yeah. Yeah. sort of have in this that the other ones didn't. There were three spectacular women that were so special that they mm. were this sort of elite group. In this case, we take the elitist nature out of it and right. make it sort of like we all we we all have something to mm. offer. Mm. I mean, I got out of the movie wanting to call my friends, like, you know, we have this, we got this, we need each other. Exactly. Like, yeah. <laughs> to achieve. Yeah. So. <laughs> as I worked. Yeah. I wanted to ask you as well, I'm sure you got some, like, physical training for mm. this because the fighting scenes were very impressive. Do you think there's, like, a correlation between physical strength and being a powerful um, woman? Can be, but not necessarily. Yeah. Yeah. So, I think yeah. my, Elena pretty much sums is that up, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah, she kind of represents that in a way. Um, and she uses her brain, which is another way that you can kind of, you know, get things done. Yeah. Um, not to say that at the end of the movie she then goes through a rigorous training regime. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, she's... Uh, I, I like that. I like that also I get to kind of represent, like Kristen was talking about, anyone being a, an angel. I think Elena does kind of represent that idea that you, anyone yeah. could be, you know. And she represents the audience a little bit and you see the movie through her eyes, which is really fun as well. And a lot of screaming, <laughs> you know, she's never seen a gun before. So that was, that was really fun to play with that. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very Thank much. You. <laughs>